And as Congress meets today to formalize the results of the presidential election, a question that hangs over the proceeding, members of Congress are going to object, but will it have any real impact? John Shumway sought out a local expert to get the answer. And John, what we heard right now is that it's really going to just drag things out, bog things down a bit. Right, that's true. Now, the question is, when we talk about impact, not only impact today and for the Biden administration, but on down through history, is it going to have any impact? Now, the person I sought out is a constitutional and presidential scholar and an historian, also just happens to be the president of Duquesne University, Ken Gormley. And despite all the court battles and all the speeches, tweets, and accusations, this is what he says. This is a huge distraction. It will not change the outcome. The system held up the way it was supposed to. These were in many cases, as in Georgia, Republican officials who said, sorry, Mr. President, but you lost. And we've looked at it three times. We can't do anything about that. And I think looking back, people will say, we went too far here. We, you, we went too far to try to satisfy the will of one occupant of the White House. But this is about a country and a presidency that lasts much longer than that. And I really do think that many of the elected officials who are getting on, hitching their wagon to this uh, effort are going to go over the cliff with it, and it will not look good for them in history. Gormley says while the president might skip Biden's inauguration. I think President Trump has every intention of remaining involved. But, you know, again, you can look at history. It's filled with people who believed they had a bigger role than they really did and that this was all about them. History keeps moving, John, and it's not going to all be about Donald Trump. He had his moment in the White House and he did some good things and he did some bad things and history will look at all that. But I, I will be surprised if it, we are as focused on Donald Trump a year from now as people think will continue to happen. Gormley has written a book on the history of the presidents and the Constitution, and he's about to write the next chapter on President Trump's tenure. No doubt what happens today will be a major part of that, Heather. Appreciate it.